loves welcome back to my channel it's been a while it's been a while but i'm back um but anyway it's a very horrible time right now for south africa like things are not great at all so i hope everyone is safe at home and everyone is basically in the comfort of their house and yeah that you guys are together with your families people that are res go back home go back home let's make this video because i feel like there's a lot going on and i'm in the house and i'm watching all these news and it's just it's bad all around you know it's it's really not a great time for our country right now so i was like let me make a video where i'm not hearing about looting where i'm not hearing about how bad the poverty is in our country just kind of to take my mind off things so if you want to take your mind off things too watch this channel and i'm featuring my coffee the girl is here because there's no babes there's no babes guys here again let's get right into it Okay, so I'm basically gonna start with my eyebrows. You already know the deal. You already know what's happening. Oh, damn. I don't have a brush, Johnny. Okay, I do. Let's just brush those girls up. Brush those girls up. Make them feel good. Okay. Yeah, I did actually. It's new. And I dyed it blonde. It's not exactly what I wanted. Like I, I took it there for them to do, you know, this new trend of the hair, like having um, like blonde streaks and everything. That's what I wanted, but I didn't get that. I just got a blonde wig. I mean, it's not ugly, but it's not what I want, which is, you know, uh, but anyway, anyway, can't really complain. Okay. What is happening? What am I doing? banana guys <laughs> wow guys but it doesn't really matter one it's just it's so fucked can i even redeem that like is there anything i can do but no listen listen i can i can fix it don't worry about it We're just gonna conceal now, yeah, boy. Guys, look at that. My, my, uh, <laughs> Yo. 
What is actually happening? Brows look like a mess, like this country. What the fuck is happening? I feel like God is trying to tell me not to do this video. Because I equal in. Let me let me draw this one again. doesn't dismiss you, I do. I think I did say it the last time I mixed these two and get my color, but that's because um, I bought the wrong, this was the wrong foundation. No, this was the wrong foundation, sorry. Soft honey, I'm not soft honey, I'm not that light skin. Um, this is like pale like it's pale and i'm not pale i'm never and i am light skinned but i'm not pale like you know so i mixed soft honey la girl with um warm what was it deep it's called deep it's called deep i mixed these two let's go let's go I'm not gonna put any eyeshadow today either because again then country's in a crisis okay nobody cares about me blending my eyeshadow but yeah I just thought I could just I don't know take my mind off things so I just decided to do this because <laughs> what a mess sweetie Why is it so dark? I really feel like I'm living in a movie when it comes to South Africa. <laughs> it's like part one, part two, part three. It's scenes. Scenes, bruh. Like, 2019 was like the starter. It was like the starter for what this is. I was just talking about this with my sister, Wootin. We need to move out of the country. <laughs> I'm joking, guys. I feel like I love this country a bit too much to move out. I don't know, like, I don't know. I have some sort of loyalty towards um, South Africa. So, although I do want to travel, like, that's something I really want to do. Like, I want to explore the world, hunty, okay? I don't want to live here all of the time like i can live i can reside in south africa but i want to travel and see other countries see other cultures explore but my sister's ready to get the fuck out a lot of people are ready to get the fuck out i don't want to get the fuck out i just want to get the fuck out sometimes but i want to come back but the, the country's in shambles right now and i just really hope Uguti, there's a plan there's a plan by government to set this shit straight because nothing is making sense people are losing jobs people are getting retrenched people are looting because they don't have anything they've been let from their jobs like it's, it's a mess everything is a mess and i just hope there's a bigger picture of all of this and my gut feeling is just telling me it's not gonna get better because ramaposa's address was disgusting it told us nothing he gave us absolutely nothing i never watched it but my family did and i was like what he said they were like he said nothing 
so yeah okay but i did say i don't want to talk about eh, i don't want to talk about this like i want us to try to talk about some nails like um my love life <laughs> my non-existent love life i'm so tired i keep meeting guys that are just not for me and i'm so tired of lomas like i'm so ready to meet a guy that's for me i don't know if i don't i don't call a marriage i think i'm talking more about a, a relationship that's actually a relationship i'm ready for a serious relationship i i'm, I'm not talking about marriage i don't think i'm I don't, I don't know if i'm not ready i don't know if i don't want it but I'm just not trying to be married. Ew. Not now. But I do want to have a relationship, a serious relationship. You know. Because I'm not interested in anything less. I'm just, I'm ready, man. I'm in the vibe, you know. I'm feeling myself. I'm healed. Hallelujah, Jesus. I'm healed. Like I'm 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 ready for a relationship. A serious one. Where I'm with someone that I'm committed to. Um we we're not playing games. We're not trying to one up each other. We're both mature. We both understand that we like each other enough to commit to each other and Yeah. Like I'm ready for something like that something that's that's committed be ready guys i'm ready so i'm just waiting for mr right to come around like come on mr right come on now i'm ready for you honey come on now where you wait where you wait preferably i'd like a guy who's you know much older than i am because yeah, no, young guys, guys, no. Yeah, dating a young guy is like wasting your own time. Like, those niggas are playing so many games. They're in so many different pussies at the same time. It makes no sense, you know. I would love it if, like, my man, my next boyfriend would be Boma, 35, 40. Because I'm 22. So... I would like him to be 10 years older um and 10 years older i think is 33 10 years older than me is 33 which is not like chicken murder um but hey even 33 is young 33 is very young actually so yeah what was i saying i'm ready i'm ready where is my mr right I think funela in guys because this waiting around thing it's getting kind of boring it's getting very boring i'm ready to to commit man i'm ready to commit man come around boy come around boy like fuck you waiting for poor guy is probably like in some dumbass committed relationship when girls here yeah, um, I'm here waiting for you and you're in a committed relationship. Don't do that. Don't do that to me, but okay. Yeah, I'm ready for a man, guys. Plus, A is Corona, bruh. Like, I mean, I'm not trying to get like a relationship because I'm lonely. I wouldn't say I'm lonely. I'd say I'm bored. I'm bored with my life. I'm so bored, like. Hey guys, this concealer is not hitting. It's not stop popping. This concealer is not popping, my man. Like, as let's see. Actually, I think I'm still using my summer makeup because is it winter now? It's cold, and I'm in the house and i think it's winter it's winter yeah um so I, i've gotten lighter than i was during summer so my makeup is actually dark now it's not like 
it's not making me, it's not giving me that thing, you know? Like, I'm doing it right now and I'm just not getting a thing. I'm getting, like, nothing, you know? Like, nothing. I'm supposed to be getting that thing. Like, ooh. Like, when I put my concealer on, I want to feel like I put concealer on. Right now, I feel like I put nothing on. It's just vibes. Let's do this again. Someone different, you know it. Oh, oh, you know it. I bow, oh, oh, I bow, oh, oh. So, yeah, I think it's a bit better. I think it's a bit better. I need someone different. Imagine. What difference you I am the difference. I can be I'm every woman. It's all in me. What more do you need? What more do you need? I, I'm really not impressed with my eyebrows. I'm happy that women are kind of starting to realize that they should put themselves first and they should be kind of unapologetic about what they want in a man, what they want in themselves what they want in life in general whether you want to be a career woman whether you want to be a housewife whatever you want to be but just stand firm and, and say yeah but whether you want to be an independent woman it doesn't mean you don't want a guy that's gonna provide for you i mean who doesn't want a guy that's gonna provide for them women love to be treated like eggs we love to feel safe we love to feel like my man's got it we love to feel catered for but i feel like this new generation of men now we in the dark bruh this new generation of men want us to pay for shit now and i need these equal rights hey. i just feel like that's manipulation like of course we need equal rights because we're both human and not every girl wants to be in the house all the time so equal rights are there for a reason there's nothing wrong with them but that doesn't mean as a guy that you need to slack and not realize your role in the household um so yeah we all deserve guys that pay all our bills <laughs> you know what i'm saying i don't want to support no guy financially i'm not smoking pot you know we all deserve to be treated soft we all deserve that soft laugh we all do man and i feel like men shouldn't think just because you're independent and just because you handle things yourself and you pay for your shit that they shouldn't of course i pay for my shit who else is gonna pay for my shit okay so we all deserve that like every single one of you ladies deserves that if that's what you want if it's not what you want if you want a 50 50 household that's cool as well it's your life you should live your life how you want to but i'm just saying my, the way I want to live it is my man doing shit for me, period. I just, I don't know, I like feeling taken care of. Like, I just like it when my man handles things. Like, it, it feels so nice when your man gives you money. It feels so nice when he protects you, when you know that, oh, baby, has it handled. It just, it feels really good. <laughs> like, I don't know how I'd feel knowing that I have to also pay bills in the house. Like, ooh, the ghetto. For me, the ghetto for me. Don't take offense. If it's not something you like, it's fine. But I'm just saying, not for me. Not for me. Everything is in shit economically. I'm just thinking, are oh, niggas really doing that well? Like right now, under this economy. Like, I wonder how it's how it's going. Huh? Where how are our husbands doing? Yo, they're probably suffering, yo. Ah ah ah. Shame. Hey, I'm sure Jay, they are suffering. But by the time they come to us, they won't be suffering. How? Come on now. By the time they come to us, I, they won't be suffering. They'll, they'll be good. They'll be good. They have to be good. We'll pray for them, guys. We'll pray for your, our, our future men. 
this this thing that girls like doing where they put the blush here but i don't think i've got the facilities for that i don't think i've got this the facilities for that i don't think i've got the facilities for that i don't think i've got the right kit here you know to start doing things like that i don't think i should do that i think i'm jumping the gun a bit so yeah i've done my blush i've done my bronzers eyelash time and will be good then that's gonna be the end of it but i don't put my eyelashes on camera but let me show you guys my eyelashes how do i do this with yeah okay there's my eyelashes i bought them at blaze for like 20 rand what the price is here for 20 rand so i'm gonna put them on off camera let me show you the glue that I use. I actually use hair glue. Hair bonding glue. It's very strong. Very, very strong. Um, yeah. I put it because it's strong. Like It's not like those white ones that they sell with the eyelashes. Total waste of time. So let me go and come back. I actually put my my lashes on and i was just drawing my my lips and then i forgot damn you're not recording <laughs> i'm gonna be so loud but uh yeah i was just doing that i think i'm gonna put concealer and then put gloss i'm gonna go take my my gloss the gloss okay kind of digging this okay i'm not mad i'm not mad let me just <laughs> hi maybe let me try change i don't know like what did i do wrong ah, but okay this is my look at the end of the day this is what i did i hope you guys liked it i hope you guys liked the mess of this video because it was a mess but <laughs> but i think i'm done but okay Thank you guys for watching i hope i distracted you guys enough from this whole looting mess and yeah i hope you guys are safe and well at home sun tandy sun lavi see you next time Mwah. Ooh, ah, the ghetto the ghetto the ghetto